Saba. Hi, William. Hello. Eurovision 2017 was in Ukraine. We celebrated diversity, and we are about to celebrate diversity again by reacting to the finalists of Vid Beer 2020. Are you ready? Let's do this. <laughs> All right, first up, it's Jerry Heil. She's a famous YouTuber, oh. I believe. Yeah, she's quite, um, she's a comedian as well. Mm. Um, her song is called Vegan. Oh, okay, well, I think we know what this is gonna be about. <laughs> Hitting, girl, put your earphone in. Yeah, that's right, in. Hitting slate. I love their font, don't you? Mm -hmm. Very chic. Oh. oh, wow. I like that. Oh, yeah, refrigerator. Is she inside? Oh my god. This is what I love about Ukraine. They go over the top. <laughs> that fridge has some delights. I like this. It's funny. It's funky. <laughs> that LED is banging. Welcome to Las Vegas. Yeah. <laughs> Instead of Las Vegas. She looks like the kids from Miss Becky. Junior Eurovision? Okay. Pity about the subject matter, because actually it's a good beat, good visuals. It leans a bit juvenile. Yeah. But that's likable though. I love the staging. Vidbeer always does it big. Right, but it's really leaning joke act as well. Yeah, it's too gimmicky. It feels unfinished, but I like her charisma. I like her attitude. And actually, I like her voice. Are we going to sit through all of this? You know, this is losing my interest. Let's move Should on. We... Let's move yeah, on. let's move on. Let's move on. All right, nice effort. Nice effort. Next up, I don't know how to say that. Crutby? <laughs> Marna Crutby? The song is 99. Rot Balloon. Uh, yeah, yeah. <laughs> 99. <laughs> Rot Balloon by Lena. Nina? Lena. I thought it was Nina. <gasps> it is Lena. Lena's the Eurovision. Yeah, it is Nina. <laughs> 99. 99. <laughs> Balloons. Anyways, hitting play. I'm surprised you know that, by the way. Weren't you in High America? High school German, honey. <laughs> Oh, is that a tattoo on her thigh? Oh no, her arm. Is that a mandolin? Oh, I like that. Spiritual. Drama. Okay, what's happening? Girl, lean back. <laughs> <sighs> nice graphic. I think that graphic had a nose job. Look, mm -hmm. she can't breathe. Angelic voice. Mm. Very big instrument. Okay. It's, it's moving. It's got merit. She's beautiful. This is very dreamy. This is, even the background, this is something you would see in your dreams. Mm. Is it fantasy? Is it reality? Yeah. It's a little kooky. But it's not really going anywhere. The graphic is going somewhere. It seems to nod to traditions of the northern, like in the north? Like something indigenous, something something spiritual, the northern lights. Bring a sand lady on board. Well, I think they need a gra the graphic lady will do. There's something about, I'm trying to say this feels bigger than like a pop song. It seems to be rooted in something spiritual. Is it bigger than us? This is better than bigger than us. Because this has personality. I mean, this has a point of view. This is not generic. I like the cat. Is she burning the cat? <gasps> They're burning a cat! What a beast! I, oh, don't, I don't dislike it. 
But I'm not in love with it. No, I'd, I'd buy the children's book and give it to my nephew. Yeah. But I'm not listening to it. Shall we move on? Let's move, Let's move on. on. All right, next is Goa? Like in India or Go A? All I know is the song is so It would be more fe. Go A, I would think. Go A, young yeah. woman. So the they, here we go. Oh, I, really I love the these graphics. graphics. This is on point. Oh. Oh. <laughs> Emily DeForest forgot her man. This is more edgy than Emily DeForest. No, the flute guy. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. I like the darkness here. Oh. Oh, wow. Wow. Is she, oh. What's that, sand? Or Flour? Powder? Cocaine? What is it? <laughs> He's beating something. This is edgy. Okay, this is very cool. Mixing something traditional with something very modern. I'm oh, sorry, this has very little appeal. No, this is good. This is a mind F-U-C-K. Beautiful woman in red, very sleek, very strong, very spiritual. Oh, the gods are calling. This the is gods like, are calling. This is like this is a good. solo Tulia just yelling into my ear. It does have a Tulia vibe, oh, doesn't it? I'm over it. No, 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 but this. This is much less happy than Tulia. I, I, and much. See, this flute sound. William, I no, this is good. cannot deal with it. This has personality. Yeah, look at this. This is a dance that would go viral. Ugh, I'm over it. I'm feeling it. But why is the camera leaning? I like this. I think she could emote a bit more, but maybe because the song is so high pitched, she can't move her face. Her face seems static. I love the drummers. <laughs> I mean, it's not a party song, it's an art piece. Don't you think this is interesting and has texture? No. Has point of view, no. perspective? No. No. Okay, now she's emoting. Look into the camera. Too Back little, to the flute. Too late. Oh. And then we're at the club. The dance beat is in, the production's on point. Very Ukrainian. This is Ukrainian. Oh, yeah. This is really needlessly high pitched. It sounds like she's saying salivate, doesn't it? Oh. Wow. I'm not even trying to deduce what she's saying. I just know that my ears want to shut down. This is like the bulldozer. It's already, they've blown up the house, and now the bulldozer is moving all the pieces out. It's angering. Sometimes you need anger to get things done. You know what? You can also press mute. Wow. <laughs> you know, this is not... You know what? The rhythm of this, to me as an American, speaks to like First Nations music. Like there's something... Like you listen to those. Oh, I'm from Georgia, honey. The Trail of Tears you started be there, from so there. we have a history of kind of studying these things. And I'm telling you, there's something about the oh rhythm my God, here. William, the rhythm. I have never heard anything more inauthentic. What are you talking about? <laughs> Do you not get an indigenous kind of very spiritual feeling or sound from this? Just tell me when you're ready to move on. No, you don't like that. You see I'm no merit in done. that. You see no merit in done. that. Done. Why? Done. 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 I would listen to that on Spotify. Oh. I would listen to that during a shaman ceremony. I uh, would. Oh, oh. How many did you go to in 2019? How listen. many shaman ceremonies? Uh, how many ayahuasca? No, I'm just kidding. I ain't never been to an ayahuasca session. All right, we're moving on. I think there's a lot of promise in that. I've I think heard that you. I've heard of you. the three we've heard so far, it's the most original. We need to move on. It's the on. most original. We it's got the most perspective. Need to move on. All right. Where have we gone? Next up is Kayat. Do we sniff this one then? Kaya, what's Kaya? <laughs> it's some kind of drug. Oh, okay. Well, <laughs> you can either chew that. it or you or you ground it up and sniff it. It's like peyote. It's popular in the Somali Republic. And I'm not yet Somalia busy. and the Eastern Djibouti. Horn of Africa. Uh -huh. I see. Okay, great. You're, you're, Have actually, you had Kaya? It's called, it's called cat. All right, well, we're moving on to this call for love. No, I haven't had it. Call for I'm very love. Hitting play. 
paint you, darling. These graphics, I love these graphics. Love it. Oh. Ooh. Gripping open. That that's up. Yeah, that's Girl. good. That's good. Love that green light. Very House of Slytherin. Oh, yeah. I like these female warriors. That's very Mihai Tristeri. Yes. That, that falsetto, isn't it? What language is this? Is English. that English? Oh, yeah. That choreography is on point. This has a vibe. Ooh. I love the staging. Very out of space. It's very creative. Very Matrix. Yeah. I'm, the, are the vocals good? Yes. Uh... Oh. Uh... That background vocal has too much presence. I think they're not mixing well. Mm. It's like they're competing for the spotlight. So turn her down so he can shine. Oh. Call for love. This is good. This is good. Oh, I like. This is really good. Yeah, I really like that okay. visual. This is presentation. This is well done. It's a little cheesy in a good way. The enunciation needs improvement. And the transitions need to be smoother. I can oh only God. understand like 30% of what he's saying. I find it weirdly saying. erotic. I think that's deliberate. <laughs> you want some water? You seem thirsty. I'm thirsty. <laughs> this has a vibe. This has a very specific that is that yodeling is not working. Is it, is it too low oh for you? Oh my god, the light show is amazing. It reminds me of Oh, oh that's, that's really nice. Sister, work that magic. There's an Eastern quality, Buto. Yes. Kabuki with the drama. And very strong sort of Euro dance sensibilities as well. Yes, yeah, celebrating diversity. Yeah. He's likable as well. I feel like he's really into this performance. You know what? He's visually memorable. He's yeah. gripping, and he's captivating. This is not generic. Oh, this sister. is really well staged. This is has well staged. got movement. Man. The last act was red. This act is green. They're serving gifts. Christmas honey. This is good. So weird. I love it. Okay. That was weird. You know, you, 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 know, you know what? The parts I don't like about this song, or actually, let me just say the song, because the song is actually not that good, but the performance yeah. can be fixed. Yeah. You can really improve and super slay on that. You can turn the backing vocalist down. Yes. You can work on his vocals in that yeah. yodeling part, and you can improve the enunciation. And you can strip back some of the verses. Clearly, this is not a song. It's a so performance. It's a performance. So he doesn't need to sing that much. To cut yeah. back some of the verses and just let him do his call for love, for love. This is, there's a lot going on here. They have a concept, right? And like Eurovision, you have to think about, can this translate to a big stage? This can translate to the Eurovision stage. Intergalactic, outer space. And yet still Euro so grand, grounded mm. on the dance floor. He's wearing, his outfit is almost like a martial arts outfit because he is here to move, to fight for the wind to slay. And the synchronicity between him and the two female dancers is actually quite perfect. You know, in the Marvel Universe, Joker, black, green, you know what I'm saying? There is a superhero element here. Yeah. But he's relatable, so you, you kind really of likeable. feel like he's your friend who's going to save you rather than some kind of superhero from outer space. Because my man needs saving too. So, this, yeah. like, this is contending. This is contending. My, my, my favorite so I, far. I think overall, this is probably my number one so far. Goe is nipping at the heels. But Kaya, I think, oh, I don't know. She was probably a better vocalist. You are so populist. No, 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 no. Go Away is not a popular song. That's going to put people off with its spirituality, its originality, its, it's perspective. shamanic leaning. Yes, the, there's a peyote element to that. No, there is. Something is going on. She's having a ceremony. Any case, we Who's need to move next? on. We need to move on. This is Dvorci. Okay. Dvorci. Um, hitting Palais. Bonfire. 
Where's the song? What's the song? Oh, Bonfire. Bonfire. Ooh, Anthony and the Johnsons. Soulful. Oh! oh. Soulful. Um, the vocals in that chorus are not good. The vocals are excellent. I'm just waiting to see where this is going to go. You think this vocal was on point? No. This vocal was not on point. Are you listening? Yeah, I like the vocals actually. Mm, I don't no, like the song structure. I, I like his attitude, his swagger. Yeah. I don't think the vocal is good. And the I chorus like the vocal. I just the chorus think... isn't him. The chorus is backing. There is just no discernible song structure. I like the tone of his voice. I just don't like the singing. I'm ready him to say live, work, pose. He's got that kind of announcer voice. Uh, I, this is not musical for me. I'm sorry. Can we move on? Oh, wait, wait, wait. I don't like this. He is gripping me. Is my headphone dying? I just feel noise. Oh, I like a DJ though, hey? <laughs> this is like so hard to all the Fed Show boys where one does all the work, the other just like. <laughs> 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 I understand what you mean by it's the, the chorus. Least interesting. Yeah, Can the chorus is just not. There's, I need voices in a chorus. I'm not a fan of these kind of. Let's let the backing take over the in, the digital sounds. All right, the final act in this selection is David Axelrod. Okay, hitting play. The song Horizon. is Horizon. This show is really well done. Yeah, it's really good. I'd love to go to Bit Bit one day. All the stars are coming down. Beautiful voice. I'm already bored. I love his hair. This is very Phantom of the Opera. He's only done two lines. I know, but I already get that sense. I see wings. Do you see wings or are those palm trees? Did Jackie Deck write this? Now I got a clue. That's funny. I can see wings. Okay, I, this is so cliche. He can sing. Let's get to the chorus. This is a shame he's singing this. I love his hair. My this girl. is not a shampoo commercial, it's a sign contest. Don't hate me for liking good things. What? His hair? His hair is beautiful. He must use conditioner. Can we get back to the song? I think he uses... Oh, I'm sorry. This is... A, I think he's done a Brazilian blow dry. This is, you're not talking about the song. Carotene, honey. Okay, you like his weave, but do you like the song? Oh, I guess I have to listen to the song now. This is like... I'm sorry. <sighs> he's so stiff as well. <laughs> No, this is a no. I'm sorry. Let me know when you're ready. I'm gonna take a nap. I'm just gonna... Don't worry, we won't hit the second verse. I wanna have myself some Chinese food. Oh, girl! Get some wooly wooly. Girl, get with it. <laughs> Hurry, are you done? <laughs> you're killing me some... Oh, that vocal lift. Uh, I, I'm sorry. Are you... Are you still listening? My love. Oh, he's gone into like... The key changed already. Girl. Oh my god. No. Of course there's a key change. Another one. Because this is so cliche. This is so cliche. He's got Taya Garrett's wings. He's got Rocco's wings. 
He's got everybody's t-shirt. All the people that got, never advanced to the final. Like, well, oh, there's the wind machine as well. Yes. Very careful. Una de Carola. <laughs> this is too much. The universe of, you know, every junior Eurovision act ever in the background. I'm done. What's the name of that guy? He might as well start going like this. And have like, a crap dance. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> Despina wind, Olympus. Yeah, the wind machine. <laughs> Which is more like a fan. Okay, I'm sorry, this is too much. <laughs> oh, the hair! Of course the hair is blowing. Okay. I'm just, I'm not a fan of this. I'm really not. Okay, and we made it to the end, you but know? Just because we were talking about other songs. Okay, listen. They're, okay, they're William two, Lee Adams. There are two clear standouts for me. Solove. Just narrow it down to one, please. No, I need to give my people. analysis. Okay, so Goe and Kayat are my two favorite. But if I had to vote for one, I would probably vote for Kayat. Because I think his overall package is more gripping. But Goe is a better vocalist. But Kayak can improve on his vocals, and they can fix the things that are problematic. Um, so my vote is Kayat, but um, Goe is a close second. She's very strong. I just think maybe that song's a bit more divisive to a mainstream audience because of its spirituality. Whereas Kayat has a performance ready to go. Among the blind men, the one-eyed like man is king. king. You have six choices here. I'm not even gonna give you a runner-up. Let's just, you know, Kayat really just steals the show for me. He has a strong visual identity. He, you know, his dancing and his locking just completely mm. pops. I really like the out of space concept. You know, you kind of likened it to the Matrix. I think, you know, there's, yeah. a, there's a superhero vibe here, but not him being the superhero. You know, the, the listener or the viewer is the superhero. And I really like how inverted that is. I guess whilst I don't remember the song, it has no discernible... Oh yeah, what was the chorus? Yeah, there's no melody. David Axelrod's yelling kind of pushed it out of my memory. And I remember that. You gotta rise up. You wanna rise Oh, rise up. <laughs> Not rise up. Oh, call rise for love. I, like, honestly, I could not tell you the melody, but I it can't. was my favorite performance. That and again, and I really real like that sort of um, martial arts sort of theme mm. and... Yeah. Bridging in East Asia and Ukraine. And can I just say that Kayat has been in Vidvi before with a really good song and he didn't go that far. He didn't go that far. Well, he I, deserves to be in the final this year. He deserves to kind of be in the final this year. Overall, though, it is a weak selection. Funny enough, we're running a poll on WeeBlogs.com and I've just seen the results. And it is very, very close, funny enough, between my two favorites. Go A with Solve and Kayat, who's in second place, with Call for Love. Only two votes separate them. Between them, they have 70% of the vote. So it looks like a two-horse race, according to our readers. Well, nobody seems to like David Axelrod. Well, except for I Devin Adarimi, WeeBlogs.com. I love his hair. But William Lee Adams, WeeBlogs.com oh, loves I truly, Kayat. I truly cannot deal. What, with William Lee Adams, WeeBlogs.com. I truly cannot deal. <laughs> in any case, that's what we think. What do you think of the six finalists in Ukraine's Vidbeer 2020? Who would do the best at Eurovision? Who is your favorite? And who are you listening to on Spotify? Let us know in the comments down below. Kayat has to win this. Follow us on multiple social media platforms. We're on Twitter, we're on Instagram, we're on Facebook, and we're on YouTube. Yeah, and we'll see you later. Bye!